In previous video we saw types of shallow foundation and their uses. In this video we will see the types and functions of a deep foundation. If the width of the footing is equal to or less than its depth then it is considered as deep foundation. Deep foundation may be of following types pile foundation, pier foundation, well foundation. Pile foundation. A pile is a long vertical member in which the loads are taken to the lower level usually by cylindrical shape which may be of concrete or steel or even timber. The pile foundation may be adopted instead of raft foundation where no firm bearing strata exist at a reasonable depth and load is uneven. And also this pile foundation is used when a firm bearing strata does exist but at a depth such as to make spread footing uneconomical. In such case pile footing is most economical. And in the case when pumping of subsoil water would be too costly and too difficult to permit the construction of normal foundation then we will go with pile foundation. And these piles used for building foundation may be of four types. End bearing piles, friction pile, combined end bearing and friction pile, compacted pile. End bearing piles. End bearing piles are used to transfer loads through water or soft soil to a suitable bearing strata. End bearing piles are used to carry heavy loads safely to hard strata and to minimize the settlements. Next friction piles. Friction piles are used to transfer loads to a depth by means of skin friction along the length of the pile. These friction piles are generally used in granular soils where the depth of hard strata is very high. Next is combined end bearing and friction piles in which the superimposed loads are transferred both through side frictions as well as end bearings. Such piles are more common especially when the end bearing piles pass through granular soils. Next is compacted piles. These compacted piles are used to compact loose granular soils those increasing their bearing capacity. The compaction piles themselves do not carry a load. They use timber, bamboo sticks or sand as a medium to transfer the load. Next type of deep foundation is Pier foundation. It is also called as drilled crescent foundation. A pier foundation is a cylindrical column of larger diameter which is used to support and transfer loads from superstructure to the hard strata. The main difference between the pile foundation and pier foundation lies in the method of construction. Pier foundations may be of following types masonry or concrete piles. Next, drilled crescents. When a good bearing stratum exists up to 5 meter below ground level, then masonry or concrete pier is used. Next, drilled crescents are generally drilled with the mechanical means. They are largely of compressed members. Drilled crescents may be of three types concrete crescent, crescent of steel pipes or shells, crescent with concrete and steel core in steel pipes. Next type of deep foundation is well foundation. Well foundations are box like structures may be of circular or rectangular in shape which are sunk from the surface of either land or water to the desired depth. They are much larger in diameter when compared to pier foundation and pile foundation. These well foundations are used for major foundation works like bridge piers, abutments, ducts, pump house and the structure subjected to heavy vertical and horizontal loads these well foundations are used. This is all about the deep foundation and their users. If you have any doubt let me know in comment section. Please like and share the video. Subscribe to Civil today. Thank you for watching.